What's going on guys? Ryan here with Jetta Patrol and it's SDCC Day. Let's go! That's right guys, Ryan here with Jet Patrol and it is SDCC Drop Day. I don't even know how to really get into this, but I'm going to tell you right now, it was insane. Absolutely insane. I, first off, hope that you got everything you were hunting for on SCCC, uh, whether it's online or in stores, I hope you got everything you were looking for. I know there's a couple things that I wanted that I don't have. However, I can't complain because I got an awful lot of very cool Funko Pops. I'm trying to figure out like how I can show them to you. Now, let me, let me break this thing down. I went out uh, early this morning. I got to my Barnes & Noble at 8 o'clock. They opened at 9, so I got there first. That was the game plan. We talked about it on the Mega Stream last night. If you didn't get to check that Mega Stream out, holy cow, you missed out. That thing was insane, and you need to check it out. I'll put a link to that in the description below. But went to Barnes & Noble first, got there at 8 o'clock, uh, waited an hour, met some people, did a live stream real quick while I was there, and then uh, went from Barnes & Noble to Hot Topic, from Hot Topic to FYE, and then I went and saw Ant-Man, which was an awesome movie, by the way. So I did finally get to check that out. That was my first time seeing that one. So I'm going to break out the pops that I picked up. I'm going to show you up close what I, what I got, the things that I didn't get yet, and um, let's get to it. The very first pop that I picked up was at Barnes & Noble, and it was... Now, this was something new for the collection. I just talked about this on the Mega Stream, started collecting this line, but I got nearly headless Nick. How awesome is that one? So this one's very cool. I'm probably going to take this one out of the box at some point and figure out how the, like, the head thing works. I don't know. It's a glow-in-the-dark pop, and I like glow-in-the-dark pops, and I think it's really cool, and I really, really like him. The new Harry Potter packaging. I just think the artwork is awesome. I think it's a cool pop. I think the concept is awesome. And uh, eventually I'll figure out how it actually works. You, if you already know, put it in the comments down below and uh, you can show me. Uh, the other thing I got was Ant-Man. So I got the original Ant-Man. I thought this was super cool too. This was, uh, I don't know, I, for whatever reason, this just spoke to me. I, I went and saw the Ant-Man movie today, so that was cool. I don't have any of the other Ant-Man pops from the new movie. I just thought this one was cool, so I picked it up. Uh, but there's, there's Ant-Man. We've got him. Uh, oh, this one I had to have. So I actually got two of these. I got, I got one of these for my, my buddy Kent. And because uh, he had to work today, he was sick for a couple days, couldn't take the day off, so he was stuck at work and was not able to get one of these. So I got him one. And uh, yeah, this was super cool. This is going to go great with Yondu from ECCC. So this is Kraglin. Now, if you're not familiar with Kraglin, he was, uh, he kind of turned on Yondu a little bit and then he kind of turned back and, you know, the whole Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 2 thing. Um, this was just a super cool pop. I like the detail on it, I like the fin, he's got the arrow. So there's a closer look at Kraglin, and I think it's just a super cool pop. I love the detail on it. It's not quite as detailed as Yondu from ECCC, but it is cool, and it's super cool. So I'm, uh, I'm happy to have that one. And uh, they're going to look great together. So maybe I'll put him in a Mary Poppins box as well, like I've got my Yondu. I don't know. I just think he's cool. This one pop I was going to show you next, uh, I actually didn't pick up the first time I went to the store. So I bought a pile of stuff, and then I went over to Hot Topic, and I came back, and I was like, man, I kind of... I had a second thought about this one, and I went ahead and bought it, and I just, I'm just i glad I did because it's actually pretty freaking cool. Uh, but there it is, guys. Pepe Le Pew from Looney Tunes. So Pepe's pretty cool. Uh, he's got the uh, you know the, the rose thing going on the mouth. The detail's awesome. I think it's a cool pop. Now, he is uh, he's a troublemaker. There's nothing wrong with that. He's a troublemaker, but uh, I just thought it was a cool pop. I do have the other Looney Tunes pops. I've got... Uh, I got Flock Gossamer, I've got Flock Bugs Bunny, I've got uh, Tweety and Sylvester, I've got some other ones, right? And so I thought this one would be cool to fit in the collection, so I got him. So that was a, they actually only had probably six of these, maybe 12, they might have had two cases, they might have had 12 of these. And they didn't sell out immediately, and when we went back they had two left, I grabbed the one with a good box and left the other one. So uh, the rest of them, they had piles of Ant-Man, they had piles of... Uh, nearly Headless Nick, and Kraglin, not so many. Not so many. They sold out pretty quickly. This last one, uh, it was, I had a debate in my head. I'm going, what do I do with this thing? Uh, and I had a live stream with my friends over at the Castlecast, and Heather was over there telling me, you love Game of Thrones, you collect all the Game of Thrones stuff, you've got to buy this thing. And I said, no, 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 not, not happening, not happening, not going to do it. Um, and she kind of, I'm not going to say she bullied me into it, 
but peer pressure might be a good term for it. I don't know, but I got these things and yeah, I'm kind of glad I did. So I got the four pack of the Game of Thrones dragons, guys. Check it out. So I'll give you a little close up look without the glare. Can I do it without the glare? Bam, how about that? Yeah, that's pretty cool. So you've got Rhaegal, uh, you got Drogon, you got Viserion, and you got Icy Viserion. And I just think these are pretty freaking cool. So I've got a pile of dragons. I've got three pack metallic dragons. I've got the six inch dragons. I've got the individual uh, three inch, three and three quarter inch uh, dragon. I've got all, I like the dragons. And uh, I, I don't know, I just thought it was cool. So I picked it up and uh, Heather, you were right. I got it. 